What up guys, Kevin here, looking at the beautiful X90K. And what would make it even more beautiful is if VRR is enabled and it does support VRR. Um, you probably did what I did. You went to settings here on your PS5, went to screen and video, video output, VRR, there it is. Oh, it's just on off. I got to turn it to automatic. And you got this lovely message. Your TV doesn't support VRR. I just spent $1,500 on a 2022 TV made for gaming and many other things. It should support VR. It does. I'm going to show you how to fix that. What you want to do just on your television, on your remote, go to home. And then you want to scroll all the way over to your Google account. Is that ICP? Yep. ICP is still out there doing their thing in 2022. That's how you know there is no God. Then you're going to go to your Google account, go to settings. Shout out to all my juggalos out there. And then you're going to go to channel, channels and inputs. And scroll over to external inputs. Scroll over again and go to HDMI signal format. Okay. And then you're going to scroll over again. And I don't remember which ports. I'll say on the back of the TV which ones are like 2.1 enabled. I know HDMI 3 is, has an E arc slash arc. Oh, it looks like 3 and 4 is. Duh. Just see it right there. 3 and 4. So you got to make sure that um, your PS5 is in HDMI 3 or 4. Right now, my PS5 is in HDMI 3. Right now, it's just an enhanced format. Displays the images from 4K supported devices with priority on image quality. Then I can go enhance format Dolby Vision, which I don't believe PS5 has yet, or if it's even coming. And then enhance format VRR. Select this option only if your game console supports variable refresh rate. Picture mode is fixed in game, and some picture settings are restricted. Now, I've been getting this question a lot. Will it? You know, how good is a VRR? Sounds like you're not going to be able to get Dolby Vision if you do have VRR enabled. I don't know about the resolution and all that. This is all new to me. This is my very first, like, VRR television. But I just want to at least show you how to turn VR on on your console. You have to go here, select VRR Enhanced Format. Then we can go back to PlayStation 5. And... Oh, look, I got to just do all this again. Following settings have been optimized for your TV. Okay. Ouch. Right. Sorry about that. Okay. There we go. VRR automatic. It is now supported. And I can go down and apply to unsupported games. So what that means is when they announced VRR a few weeks ago on PlayStation, there was probably a list of about like 10 to 15 games that were you know, built for VRR or they got an update for VRR and it'll still work for apply to unsupported games. Um, one game is Plague's Tale Innocence. Really bad um, screen tearing. That's a video I'll probably test out to see if that fixed. But that's at least how you turn it on. Again, I'll need to do a little bit more research on how great the VRR works. Again, I there's games that are specifically updated for it but at least we got to turn on and that's how you do it so there you have it please like the video and yeah if you have any more questions on this tv let me know in the comments and thank you so much for watching later